All right, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. Back working on the Civic today. Today is wrapping things up. Not too sure if we're gonna get the VTEC done today, but Corey is running wires. Getting new battery terminals on the car. And Eli's over here, heat wrapping. I'm about to join him and help out here. So let's uh, prop the camera up. See what a time lapse of heat wrapping looks like. Yeah. Darling, you send me Darling, you sent me, I know you sent me, darling, you sent me, I know you sent me, darling, you sent me, darling, you sent me, I know you. All right, so we got the headers heat wrap for the most part. It gets really tricky once it gets down to there, it's so tight. Now I think we're just gonna take the rest of the spool and then wrap it fully around the thick part and then call it done. But those look really good for now. Okay, everybody, so right now we got one wire and two wire. This one with the yellow tapes, A4. So that's going to the VTEC solenoid and then this one's doing the pressure switch let's see. yeah for sure and then that's what corey has been working on you see there you see those two new red wires coming out of it and that's all vtech stuff and i'm sure it's gonna work perfect thanks corey appreciate it okay so right now eli's just doing the good old double nut trying to get those off oh yeah got it yeah taking the studs out so we can replace them with these Oh yeah, they're going to so much better. J2 Industries bolts with the beauty washers. I just went with black because I figured it's for the header anyways. Yeah, it's probably uh, going to be turned black anyways after like... Yeah, right? Grab it for a bit so I was like, eh, I'll just go for the black ones. They did have purple and red and all that, but I was like, eh. We got lots of that already. Thank you. So hell yeah. So we have an issue. Um, senior stud is stuck in the head. Uh, yeah. Good old Eli knows what he's doing. I know what I'm doing. Little unfortunate events here. Couldn't end up getting that broken stud out, but it is what it is. It's gonna have a little tiny exhaust leak. I'll probably take it to the speed shop and see if they can do something with it. And if not, then well, there's just never gonna be one there. <laughs> and other than that, VTEC is pretty well wired. So that's exciting. It's pretty well, it's totally wired. Right? Totally wired just cleaning it up now all right headers are heat wrapped they're on with the uh, j2 dress up bolts <laughs> giving them the old ugga dugga yep that's my torque torque oh yeah they're just back very nice dang oh, that looks really good actually yeah, i'm stoked we got to slap a radiator in there and turn this thing on now. Yeah, we still might have to cut the hose shorter because that's... Yeah. Yes. And the intake. <laughs> it won't come back for a long time. I had to do that so much. Put it out a bit. Oh, there's a bunch of bubbles coming through now. Yeah, keep flying. Oh my God, he's in there. Why don't you fucking telling me? Remember that part? <laughs> <laughs> Is it moving the fluid? Oh yeah, it's on the bubbles. Yes. Very nice, man. Who believes? Who believes? Is it coming back yet, Corey? Mm, not yet. Yeah. Okay. Good for everyone. I replaced the master cylinder and the slave cylinder last year. You opened up? Not yet. Once oh. it gets pressure behind it, I'll get him to hold it and then I'll open it up. Into the Are you having fun? I am. Ooh, I love I'm pumping. Good. Pumping. It's fun for me. Wow. Just want to get a a view of my pump action. Oh, hell yeah. You got the view of the pumping action? Pumping action. Here, just hold it down. Oh yeah, that was air. Keep pumping. It was black. Okay, hold it down. Keep pumping. Oh, there you go. Any more pressure? Uh, it's coming back now. Okay, hold it down one more time. It's coming out in a straight line, so just keep pumping and fill, I guess. Oh, yeah. That's it. Big time. 
it clear come out? She's done. Was it coming out black anymore? No. <laughs> you need a hand? We're good. Oh my desk. Oh. And even. Oh, well, you got it. Oh, I don't think you even have to cut it either. Eh. Oh, yeah. Eh. Just chuck me, shove it down, down. So, what are you fucking doing? Harpender, what in the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> um, that goes down there. Yeah. <laughs> it pushes it forward so much. Can we bend this fucking thing? Bend yeah. this fucking thing. What a hoopty, man. Fuck, man. What do we do here? We get the big boys. Odd being so close. You bitch, motherfucker. Here, can I see those? I do not see anything. That was quite fantastic. Weird. We are putting in some coolant RN. I hope we have enough. We're just gonna have to get it with some distilled. Did you just say RN as in right now? Sweet. <laughs> I'm hip as fuck. Integra all over again. That's like kind of crazy. Just give it a twist, even. Ah! I mean, I did run a garden hose into this thing at first, so. Oh, From the apartment. It's the key without the sharpie on that. Look at the smile on his face. <laughs> Very faint. Oh, that gauge looks nice. Hell yeah. Tell us when. Okay, ready? Yep.
Everybody, it's running. We literally did it, dude. This we did it, man. Our first swap, and it runs awesome. Absolutely. actually insane. That's intense. So then what's left after this? Just intake, put the intake on, put bolt the header to the rest of the exhaust and drive it. Make sure that gauge works. Yeah, put the bumper on. Yeah, put the bumper on. Which is like two bolts, so yeah, that's pretty really easy. Good. So once we get that going, then we're fucking set. We'll take her for a rip. Money, yeah. Next time we just gotta like tighten up that torque and shit, but I never had one for like the last two years. So what are you gonna do? Yeah, screw it, dude. <laughs> Who gives a fuck anyways? Is it moving? No, but I found it. Oh, yeah. The car's been running for about five or so minutes now. Um, for some weird reason, the uh, our temp gauge doesn't work, but that's okay. We're gonna get that sorted. The actual one in the cluster does now, so something must have been fucky with the ECU and or the sensors, which that's what you get on a car that's 30 years old. But I mean, even when you rev it, the thing doesn't shake. It's hardly vibrating. All you guys know the crazy sounds it used to make from the trans that we used to write off as a lightweight flywheel, which it still probably wasn't. Um, it's gone now. Yeah. So hell yeah. And dude, just looking at the front with the heat wrap, the dress Let's up the with the red. Works. Okay. Yes, doctor. Yeah. It works. It works. Okay. It's at 83. Perfect. Okay. So I don't know what Corey Great. did, but he did it. One of your first wiring it up because then it's like, okay, well, that's just a single wire. That still has to have power going through the sensor. Yeah. You'll have to run another power wire just from there underneath to it and then shoot something on. You wanna do it? Uh well we got pressure in here now. Oh. Yeah we can do it. But uh, I think also it's kind of that idle is because like not all the vacuum lines are fully on and everything. Oh yeah for sure. But it still runs super good surprisingly well. So we're I need to loosen that off. The adjustable one? Yeah. Towards you? Towards me? Yeah. <laughs> the coolant temp now works. It's at 83. It smells like a boat. Well, it smells like a boat motor, yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, I guess the thermostat opened. Well, it's still right there. Yeah. Still at 83. Yeah, it's 
could not be more pumped right now, guys. Come on the bubble. Okay, so we're just waiting for the fans to kick on. The thermostat did open. Now the fans need to come on around 91 to 95. And we're sitting at 88. So we're waiting for the fans to come on at the moment. Did it? Okay, yeah. that would make sense. Okay, good. Okay, so a little update. Car got to about 100 degrees and the fan's supposed to come on between 90 and 95 and long and short, it didn't. So now we're just diagnosing and uh, worst comes to worst, I got to order a fan kit. It's going to be a lot of wiring and shit, but uh, we'll get it working one way or another. I got the faith. This ever, Out of everything, that little fan not spinning is great. That's nothing. Mm -hmm.